Last time on Paper Mario. I know that you'll be able to defeat Bowser. He's doing some magic. Ooh! Well, I could probably take him on. I wish we could uh, really welcome you, but we're in big trouble. Hey everybody, what is going on? I'm Mojo Stitch. I want to welcome you back to some more Paper Mario. Today, we are here in the Koopa Town. I forgot what this town is called. Um, and they are having a wild fuzzy outbreak. So we're here to go ahead and help out the village and take care of these damn fuzzies. If we can, if we can, if we can hit them. Um, we have some coins, a lot of stuff hidden throughout, um, and all that. Oh, we got a Koopa leaf. Um, I think we'll drop it for a... Mm, ah, we're not gonna drop it. Go ahead and get rid of that. But we do have to get rid of all these fuzzies. Actually, I don't think we have to get rid of all the fuzzies. I think they'll get rid of themselves. But we do have to get all the shells back for the Koopas. Oh, you're the best. Thank you very much. Thank you. I already know. You didn't have to tell me. Do, 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 do. You're going to say something, bro? You're going to say something? I just saved your life. Oh, thank you, Mario. I owe you one. I just can't walk around without my shell on. Talk about embarrassing. Mario, be sure to keep your shell safe from fuzzies, all right? Oops, you don't have one. Well, watch your overalls. Yeah, these fuzzies really finna come out my overalls. There we go. So yeah, we again we just have to come around here and help the village out with the, with all the fuzzies and stuff. Thanks, Mario. The shell is made uh, to order. That's why it fits so well. I mean, how cool do I look? <laughs> don't don't like turtles grow their own shells, right? Am, am I mistaken? All right, this guy is really hard to get. So so th there's like a way. I'm not too sure if there's a there's a. I don't want to talk to you, bro. I don't want to talk to you. I want to get I want to get get to the get to what we got to get I like I think if you keep jumping come on dude all right he's going left so I'm uh, he's going to jump out he's going to jump out he's got to jump out come on bro dude the, the difficulty spike like all the ones are so easy to get and then this diff we get like a difficulty spike like come on dude I almost had him for a second Dude, are you for reals? Come here. Hold on. Am I gonna, am I wasting my time with this guy? I have to get this, dude. Come on. Come on. I have to get this. I have to get this. Dude, can I get this? I mean, is this possible? This is possible to get, right? I swear I've gotten this before. Hold up. All right, come on, dude. Do it. I'm kind of running out of patience. Oh, you have to walk slowly up to it. Oh, my God. I never knew that. Dude, I never knew you had to walk slowly to it. Thank you, typical Mario style. You're just as cool. Dude, what the hell? I never knew you had to, you had to walk up slowly to it. That's crazy. The, the more you know, man. Jeez. That's actually pretty cool. I didn't, I didn't know that. Like, I genuinely did not know that at all. All right. We help all these Koopas get their shells back. I think that's pretty much just about it. And right here, we have to come here. I don't think we get anything for helping the mom. Uh, who's there? I'm kind of busy right now. I don't know. A, 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 a voice for him. What? Wait. Could be, aren't you, Mario? You are. My name's Cooper. Oh, I'm psyched to meet you. Used uh, us meeting here has got to be fate or something. I need a huge favor. I hope you'll help me out. This well, wild fuzzy uh, took my shell, which next to my life is the most important thing I have. I can't go out on my shell, period. Way too embarrassing. The problem is fuzzies are too fast for me to catch alone. So if you don't mind, can you help me get my shell back? I'm begging you. All right. Hey, Mario. It looks like he's in a, he's, uh, in a bad way. We ought to help him out. The fuzzies took my shell just inside my house. I'll guard the door while you grab him. Womp. All right, so this guy is going to jump out the back. <laughs> um, I think right here you can actually change the music. I, I don't think you can change it now, but you can actually change the music to different tunes later on in the game. Um, I think you can come back here. Um, oh, again, we can fight some fuzzies. Um, I was, I was like thinking right real quick because it's been a while since I played. I was like, do we have any other partners? But we don't have any other partners. There we go. So I think these guys have three health or four health or something. Not too sure. And then also they they like suck your life. 
Oh wait, no, sorry. Yeah, they, they do they do do that, but I think it's either this game, like different ones, or like later or in the the, the other Paper Mario, um, you keep um you have to press A a bunch in order to get them off you. So there we go, four star points. We're creeping up to a level up. We're not quite there. But, um, damn, I was gonna see. Hopefully, if we get a first strike on them. Um, just so this can go by faster. Actually, I don't know if I want it to go by faster. Because we actually kind of have a boss fight. So, I don't know. Um, we'll, we'll go ahead and we'll just kill him. There's no... Alright, I got the timing right. I just wanted to make sure I had the timing down. Whoops. Alright, so let's go ahead and just get through these fuzzies, you know? You know the drill, we're just gonna get, get in our combat mode. Oh, that might be it. Oh, I can't get that HP plus yet. Now, um, I think on the opposite side of this bridge is the, is the area that we have to go to. So real quick, I'm going to go into our items and I'm gonna see if we have a honey syrup. Oh, we have a fright jar. Wait, what's the bun to use? That's party members. Left should be, yep. Um, let's go ahead and use the honey syrup. Alright. Okay, oh shoot, here it is. Here it is, guys. Uh, I remember this challenge. Oh man, New York, New York. Come get if you can. So they're gonna jump in between all of these trees, and we have to like visually use visual cues and see where they're going and see which one of the shell's in. Guess where I'm hiding? Alright, so he's in the right, left. Left, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, right. All right, so he's in the default tree. All right, there he is. Neo, who? Not bad, chump. But that was just the warm up. Of course, it's always just the warm up, right? Neo, guess where I'm hiding? Where are you hiding, mate? Right, left, left, right, 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 left. Same tree. All right, there we go. York, York, you got me twice. Must have been lucky. Now I'm serious. Now this is where he goes like pretty fast. So you have to pay really close attention. He's this one. Yes, there we go. Yo, no, I give uncle. Uh, here, take this stupid shell. All right, we got Cooper shell back. Uh, you're too tough for me. I won't be bad anymore. I promise. Maybe. All right. So, as we walk back, um, we can go ahead and give Coops a shell, and then he's gonna ask if we wanna be, uh, a partner. Hey, Mario, thank you. I realize that you have to, uh, take a stand against these fuzzies. If I can get my own shell, I'll lose my reputation. I don't even care that I have no shell on. I'm gonna show these fuzzies what and what. Um, we already got the shell back. Alright, we're gonna give Cooper a shell. Oh, yes, yes. This is my shell, all right. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Get my shell back. Uh-huh. You're the greatest, Mario. I owe you big time. Good to hear you, Mario. Or oh, good to hear you happy. Say, Mario, I have an idea. Do you happen to know Professor Colorado? Um, the, the Professor Colorado? <laughs> naturally, uh, or naturally, he's a couple as a prof professor of... Uh, prof who's a professor of archaeology. He's also known as an explorer. Right, well, I, I live next to him. I've been admiring Professor Colorado since I was in my egg. Nothing would make me happier than traveling the world solving mysteries like he does. So, do you think I could, could I? Please take me with you, Mario, I'll help. Come on, let me go. Hey, Mario, what uh, what you think? Let's go ahead and take him. Oh, yes, yes, I'm on my way. I think if you say no, he just keeps asking and asking and asking until you finally give in and take him. Cooper has joined the party. Um, press down and he'll be able to reach items. So we can, like, step on him and knock his shell and propel it and all that. Um, I'm going to see if there's anything. Are there any bushes we can go into? No? Okay. I, I guess not. Never mind, then. All right, New York. I changed my mind, sucker. How about a fight? So, um, I think Coops might be strong enough where we can kill them all in one hit. Um, but besides that, he has his power shell, so we just hold to the left. Nope. So it's not quite one hit, but uh, let's see. We can just we'll jump and then we'll we'll let him go again first. So there we go. I want to make sure I get this timing right. This is kind of like a mini boss, like a little side boss. Or not side boss because it's required, but it's just like a mini boss. 
Um, and then just because... Oh, wait, we don't have the... Alright. Well, I think he only has one. Yeah, they only have three health. Like, I, that was actually kind of close because I almost screwed myself. So there we go. They do have three health. That's good to know. Not that we'll be fighting any more fuzzies, really. But just just so just so you know, you know, future, just just so you guys know. And there we go. What is that like? Twelve um, star points. Yes, sir. There it is. New York, no. Okay, so we can go ahead and head on back. And we saw the HP plus badge that we had. Um, we can go ahead and also equip that. So, um, let's go ahead and put that on. All right, HP plus. And is there anything else out here that we can collect? I don't believe so. Unless there's like a secret hidden block or something. But I don't think there's anything left left for us to to go ahead and collect. So let's go ahead and come back. And I think is it gonna let me play the music? No, it won't let me play the music. I guess I can't I can't play the music guys um all right let's see what else there is oh okay so up here uh it spawned a star piece so let's go ahead and get that false oh and we got quizzo or whatever his name is Kawiz. I'm Chuck Quizmo the name of quizzes on my game you want quizzes I got them if you can manage to answer my brain busting questions correctly then yeah yeah yahoo I'll give you a star piece want to try a quiz yeah we're gonna go ahead and try it I think we can get it um then let's get to the question all right, question. What's the name of Goombari's younger sister? Um, Goombari, uh... Yes, there we go. Okay, I just want... I, for a second, because I knew Goombari, oh, Goombari, ah, makes sense. Like, always oh, like, male, and then ah, is, like, feminine, or, you know, whatever. Um, you've answered correct. One question so far. All right, so that was the first question. There's a lot of questions that they ask and stuff, but, um... You know, I don't know. Everyone seems cool now. Everyone's all, all chilling here. You know, look at you guys. How you guys doing? Um, and again, he lives next to Professor Colorado. So we could probably go to Professor Colorado's house real quick. And, you know, go say what's up. You know, uh, I think this is his wife. Oh, little Coop is going to go on Mario's adventure. How cute. Take care. Okay. Yeah. You ain't really got nothing to say. Anything back here? Um, this is the bookshelf in Colorado's room. Most of the books seem to be about archaeology. There are also a few that seem somewhat less intellectual. <laughs> less intellectual, lol. Wait, what's this? Okay, that's the door. I thought that was the, I was gonna be able to access the map or something like that. I was like, wow, that's that's new. I didn't know you could do that. Um, let's go to the badge shop and let's see about selling badges or or seeing what else we have. If we can clear some stuff out. Or is this the music room? Bum, bum, bum. Da -da, da -da. All right, that's pretty cool. You can change the music in there. And then there's also an inn. Um, we'll go ahead and sleep at the inn. I'm not too sure if it costs money. Does it cost money? Okay, it doesn't. So we're going to take a nap. We're, uh, naps, again, in this game, replenish all your health and all your flower points and all your star points. Um, so, again, it's always good to, every once in a while, take a nap. So, you know, that's that. And I also think it resets the room because I know Chuck Quizmo has a spawn point here. Where did you bomb bombs come from? You guys weren't here earlier to help out. All right, he has uh, Dizzy Dows, Power Block, a Volt Shroom. And Mushrooms are actually pretty cheap. Um, I want to sell. Let's see what we got. We have mushrooms that cost two. Um, super shrooms, fire flowers. Nah, we don't really have anything I, I, I actually want to get rid of. Um, do we need pal blocks? Every once in a while in this game, you'll, you'll run into enemies that need a certain, like, item that's really, really efficient on killing them. But not in this area. I know in World 2, once we get to the clefts, um... But then, then we just have to start worrying about, about like, you know, using power blocks and stuff for that. But we're full heal, so we don't have to mess around anywhere. So we can go ahead and continue on our adventure to Koopa Bros Fortress, you know, finally. And we'll go ahead and step on him just so we can go ahead and get him off his shell. Um, there's no way we can kill this guy. So I guess we'll just take the, take the, take the hit. Actually, no, Koopa can kill him. Yeah, Koopa can kill him. It's since I, it's since I used the, the power stomp. And there we go. So yeah, um, Koops has like an attack where he can directly hit one enemy or attack all enemies on the ground. And he also has a variant of that attack at, uh, once you upgrade a little more. So that's pretty cool. Are there anything up here? No, nothing to collect. I think there's a, there's a secret block up here. But maybe I'm tripping. I know later you get a... Uh, oh, shoot. Yeah, we gotta get that. Um, you get a partner and his name is Watt. And um, he can help you see undiscovered things. Um, so we'll go ahead and first. 
All right, there we go. We're 92 star points. We're really, really close to an upgrade. And in fact, this next fight should give us the upgrade. So we're going to go ahead and obviously take this next fight and then um, get on into the upgrade. Oh, man, we got it for sure. All right, so we got four star points in that fight, so it wasn't quite enough for the upgrade, but we should have an upgrade uh, rather soon as well. Fire flower, let's go ahead and get rid of the sleepy sheep, um, just because I don't think there's really any point in this, and I don't think the the boss either is, is uh, will get hurt, will get um, touched by a sleepy sheep. So um, I'm not too sure if you guys uh, saw, but that was a paracoupa, and I forgot if we we fought a paracoupa before. And here we go, we upgraded um, right now. Let's see. Um, we can upgrade our badge points to six, which is what we're going to go ahead and do. We're not going to worry about upgrading our health until the next level up. We'll do 15. But yeah, anyways, here is our first Paracoupa. Um, essentially, they float, and you have to hit them twice to knock them, not just off of their... Uh... Huh, is there a way we can beat these guys faster? No. Um, yeah, we don't. We not just have to knock them off of their uh, wings, but also back on their back as well. And there we go. One, two. So, yeah, we're still getting two um, uh, power, uh, star points, uh, an enemy just about. And, again, we're, I'm going to be skipping most of these fights from here on out as well. Um, again, unless I show off a new enemy or something like that. But, of course, um, you know, so there won't be too much fighting going on in, in these. Just a lot of, a lot of uh, story progression. We don't currently have bomb bet, so we can't, or, the, the you know, the next... Uh, person that we get to use we get three um characters in the prologue in chapter one and that is uh Gumbario, uh coops and um what's it called uh, the bombette whoa mario what the oh we're in a world of hurt mario's here already i gotta tell the leader red koopa so again um you you know your progression through this level because you you again see the uh, the 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 color koopas and I think it goes black, green, yellow, red, something, I don't know. But, um, yeah, again, you, you get to see all the, all the progression through it. So, we got another Koopa fight here. Oh, and we also have a bomb. So, we're actually not going to skip this fight. We're going to uh, fight the bomb. Um, just so we can do it. Um, the bombs have a certain health. And if you hurt the bombs enough, they'll just die. But if you attack, I'll, I'll go ahead and sacrifice the hit. If you attack them just like that, um, when they get a turn, they'll they'll use their bomb and it, they, it does two damage. So um, again, you can guard it and of course take one. But um, it's just good to know because you know it, the, the damage. I guess it can add up. You know what I mean? So here we are. We're gonna go ahead and go through and let's get through it. All right, and there we go. This room is now cleared out, so we can go ahead and advance. And there's the green Koopa. Talking with the other Koopas, trying to strategize. Ah, let's, uh, let's see the great Mario get any further now. And then we surprise and run up on him. Yeek, Mario! You, uh, don't try any. You're still never going to find your way through this fortress. Um, it looks like there might be some fighting here. How exciting. See ya. So, yeah, this guy's going to try to get an attack on us. But we'll just go ahead and step on him. All right, there we go. We got some nice hearts and flower points and stuff like that. And look, you see this item right there, the power bounce, is the best item in the game. It is so good. And as you guys see, like, he was inside the jail cell. And he kind of, like, came out of the jail cell, which, like, obviously is, like, a lure to that you can get in there. Um, so let's go ahead and get rid of these guys. All right, so let's go ahead and get the power bounce. And we can push our way through the wall. Otherwise, if you don't go through that side area, um, you can use Bombette. All right, there we go. Let's go ahead and move on to the next room. Here into the fortress, and we have another enemy. Um, I also have just thought in my head of a, of a time or a situation. Wait, is this going to let me go up or no? Yeah, it won't let me go up. Um, the Koopa Bros are all Koopas, and so if we use a Pow Block, we can knock them all down onto their backs. So we're going to go ahead and keep and use a Pow Block just for that. Um, now this area down here, um, as everything falls and the world shakes and earthquake going on, you know? Um, uh, what are the odds that, like, someone watching this, like, they watch that and then, like, a real earthquake hits? That'd be crazy. All right, do I want to go left or right? Left is the jail cell, I believe, if I'm correct. Yes, left is the jail cell. 
Um, nothing we can do here, but we do see our future. Hello, bombs and bomb bed and, and all you guys. We're going to go ahead and come back for you, hopefully, but not intentionally, by accident entirely. Um, yeah, so we're going to go ahead and continue on to the left, and we'll get the key uh, so we can move on forward. Now, this area locks us in the room. And so, if you're not prepared to fight all the Koopas, then you might be screwed. So, we'll go ahead and let's look at our stats. We might have to heal and all that, but let's go ahead and get right into it. Alright, so, and you know what? We're almost halfway to leveling up. And we also got a power block, which is actually pretty useful. Alright, there we go. Two down, one more to go. And, oh, we didn't even get the first hit. Alright, so there we go. All three are done. And now the walls are going to come down and collapse onto the floor and then we have a little quick obstacle course that we can go ahead and go through um a bunch as you guys can hear a bunch of spinny fiery we'll go ahead and, and make it on over nothing too hard i remember for some reason when i was younger like you know like your hand-eye coordination and stuff like that is not as good or whatever and i had a really hard time trying to like beat this area or like get past these fire i had no idea why i don't know dude i was a little kid you can't judge me so let's go ahead now and make our way up the stairs. Boop, 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 boop. All right. And then we'll go through the key right here. And to the fortress key. Let's go ahead and move in. Move on in. And here we are with the yellow Koopa, who looks like he's clearly working on something. Okay, this is perfect, I think. I don't know why that was so. Whoa, looks like Mario's here. <laughs> All right, so um, right now, let's go ahead and I think out here is a save block. Is it? Yes, it is. Is there like some sort of secret block out here? Is that why there's this walkway? No, but there is a chest. That walkway right there is probably just to let you know that there's a chest, you know, so you don't, so you don't forget it when you come back up. Or come back up, what do I mean? Spoilers, I'm sorry. I don't know if you guys noticed or saw down there, but there's actually water, so I don't know how this part really makes sense, but even though I'm kind of kind of foreshadowing and almost spoiling it, but here we go. We're going to go ahead and hit the block, and it's a trap door. That's what he was working on the entire time, and we didn't know because, of course, us being the fourth wall and being able to see everything, we knew, but Mario didn't. Blah, ha, ha, losers. Serves you right. You fell for it. Wow, thanks, you yellow Koopa. All right, here we are. Oh, what was that? Where did that fall from? I'm gonna give him a raspy. Oh, I wonder it just fell, but aren't you Mario? I never in a million years thought I'd meet such a famous guy in a place like this. Who, me? My name's Bombet. In case you hadn't noticed, I'm a bomb bomb. Uh, pleased to meet you. All right, guys, so this is the end of today's episode. I hope you guys enjoyed the, uh, the, the, uh, the video. I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. Um, be sure to go check out the main uh, YouTube channel, the Twitch channel. Go check out the Skyrim series and all that that's currently running. And if you're watching this in the future, go watch the new videos. Or, you know, the playlist is down in the description to watch all the videos in case you missed an episode. Or, you know, want to see the new episodes and next episodes and all that. But besides that, guys, I'm OGFH. Uh, follow on Twitter, Instagram, all that stuff. Hope you guys enjoyed. Come over, subscribe, like. And I'll see you guys in the next one where we'll go ahead and free the bombs. Um, hashtag free bombs in the comments. Peace.